Rat and mice infestations are an age-old problem, but there's still plenty of false information attached to these pests. You may be surprised by what many homeowners know, or think they know, about these rodents' habits. So in this video, we'll expose some of the false information associated with rats and mice and provide you with tips on how to control these invasive pests. You can save on pest control with DIY products and do it fast with free same-day shipping from Solutions Pest and Lawn. To shop for the products featured in this video and to learn more about rodent control, click the icon in the top right of the screen, or click the link in the description below. Early depictions in movies and television have influenced people into believing that rodents love to eat cheese. While no rat or mouse will turn their nose at the offer, cheese is actually a pretty poor bait to use when setting snap traps. The reason being that cheese on its own is very easy for a rat or a mouse to simply pick up without setting off the trap's pressure-sensitive trigger. In order for a snap trap to work, enough pressure must be applied to the trigger. To ensure that your snap traps work, we recommend you bait them with a sticky substance like peanut butter. Peanut butter is not only difficult to remove completely, but it's also got a strong scent that rats and mice can easily detect. For fast and efficient rodent control, we recommend you use Easy Set Rat Traps for rats and Easy Set Mouse Traps for mice. These traps are designed with a well in the center of the trap's trigger area. Simply fill the well with peanut butter and properly set your trap close to where you've spotted rodent activity. Any rodent in the area will detect the bait and inspect the trap. Since the peanut butter is placed in the well, any rat or mouse will have to put its body weight onto the trigger, activating the trap and ensuring immediate elimination. Cats, dogs, owls, bats, and snakes are some natural predators of rats and mice. Many homeowners believe that these animals alone are enough to keep any rodent population down, but rats and mice are smart pests that can crawl into tight spaces to avoid predators. If these animals are kept as pets and are well fed and taken care of, then they're especially less likely to hunt, allowing rodent populations to increase. Instead of relying on wildlife or pets to eliminate rats and mice, we recommend you use baits like Eradication, set within a Solutions Rat and Mouse Bait Station. By using baits, you can eliminate rats and mice without having to get your hands dirty, and the bait station provides rodents with an ideal environment to eat or shelter in. Just set the Eradication bait blocks into the station, close the station, and set up your bait station along your exterior perimeter or fence. Rodents will be attracted to the Eradication scent, consume the bait inside the station, and will die in the field within 5-7 to seven days. It may take up to 2 weeks to see a noticeable reduction in rodent activity. When rodents are invading homes, they're seeking to fulfill three basic needs. Food, water, and shelter. They aren't really particular to how clean or dirty it is. While messier homes can provide rodents with additional hiding spots, the rodent won't know until it actually invades. Once it finds its way inside, it'll start to pull nesting materials from inside and around your home. Since rats and mice invade homes indiscriminately, you'll need to prevent them from invading your home by utilizing Exclusion Materials and Integrated Pest Management, or IPM. First, inspect the inner and outer perimeter of your home for any openings pests can use to invade. These openings will need to be repaired or filled with copper mesh and caulk. Outside of your home, clear away dense vegetation, including any overhanging tree branches at least 3 feet away from your structure. Rake away any leaf litter and pick up any lawn debris. Make sure your grass is cut to its preferred length. Drain any standing water on your property. And make sure any firewood is properly stacked as far away from your structure as possible. All these things combined will ensure few pests will view your property as livable. Once you've completed Exclusion and IPM, you can monitor for any future rodent or pest activity by setting glue traps around pest entry points. The Pro Glue Board is great for mice and other small pests, while the Pro Rat Glue Board XL is ideal for rats. Swiftly pull away the trap's paper seals and set them near entry points where you've seen rodent activity. If an infestation were to arise, this would give you an early warning, giving you better control over the situation. If you, a child, or a pet got stuck on a glue board, you can use any cooking oil to loosen the trap's stickiness. People have been dealing with rats and mice for years, but the only way to successfully eliminate infestations is by arming ourselves with the correct knowledge and products necessary for control. With these professional products and tips from Solutions Pest and Lawn, you can stop rodents from infesting your home and property, and we offer same-day shipping to help you get control quickly. Visit our website to get your products today. If you like this how-to guide, please share. And if you're new to our channel, subscribe for more how-to and product videos, and contact us for more tips, tricks, and DIY pest solutions.